I'm Jimmy, Creative Director. I was using Yahoo Mail for several years and I switched to Gmail Suite. For more information, you can click below. Gmail and Yahoo both have similar functionalities. They both help you with communication all across the world. Uh, anybody has easy access. You don't have to opt into either one to be able to use them to communicate out with other people. Uh, so they both had that uh, in, in common and uh, I enjoyed that about both products. I switch over to email because it has more functionality uh, and what I really love about it is I get this 30,000 foot view by using the label system. So I put labels on all of my emails, um, noting if an uh, invoice has been sent, if a contract needs signing, if I have uh, expenses that I need to tally up uh, to a specific type of an event or occurrence. Uh, and this gives me a 30,000 foot view of all my emails. And an email chain might have 30 or 40 different conversations within it. And I can just glance at my email uh, and see all the things that are related to each email uh, without having to dig down into uh, all of those different conversations. So that blew Yahoo out of the water. Uh, so Yahoo is really good if you just need to sort of communicate with other people and uh, you want to have like news of the day. Uh, it has all of that built in. Um, and if you love fantasy sports, you can just click right up in the upper corner and go right to your team and see what's going on. Yahoo was super easy. Um, I had, Yahoo was actually my first account, got it right when the internet started and you can opt in with no problem. Uh, I also was a part of Gmail right away, but Gmail initially, you had to have an invite to get into the Gmail universe. Uh, that's no longer the case and they're both very easy to sign up and have multiple accounts. Uh, and I have probably six or seven accounts with Gmail and a couple with Yahoo. Uh, and it doesn't take very much at all, like five minutes and you can have a whole new email profile. Top considerations when you're deciding which email platform to go for is really taking a 30,000 foot view and deciding how much you want that suite of, uh, of applications to do. Um, do you need one space for calendars, emails, tasks, to-dos, uh, documents, spreadsheets? Uh, if you want that, then Gmail is sort of the one app that rules them all. Uh, and if you just need something that's light uh, and easy to access, then Yahoo's your way to go.